host, making it less likely to be noticed. So I could evolve Symbiosis 1 and make my parasite, your mom, <laughs> harder to uh, become noticeable. So, uh, yeah, I have a plan for the parasite. Hopefully this works. All right, so there's another bubble. So we have 33 DNA, 34 DNA points. Uh, okay, let's go to disease symptoms. And here's the deal. I know, uh, in the previous episodes, uh, I never mutated the symptoms. But since I have this ability of symbiosis, I'm going to try to spread the disease with uh, coughing. If you look at the infectivity on the bottom, it, it increases the infectivity coughing does. So let's give it coughing. Oh, what is this? Sne Look how much the infectivity goes up with sneezing. Okay, let's evolve sneezing. And what is this? Okay, and let's evolve this with pneumonia. Because you see, pneumonia gives more infectivity, but doesn't affect lethality. So they might not pick up on it. Okay, let's evolve that. Look at this. <laughs> you have successfully evolved your mom. <laughs> Oh, good lord. Uh, okay, let's keep popping these bubbles. There's currently 20, 31 people infected. Let's see how this starts infecting people with sneezing, coughing, and pneumonia. Look at this, it's starting to spread. 4,000 people infected, look at this! Oh, this is going good. Okay, your mom infects thousands. Oh, good lord. Uh, okay, let's go to disease. Uh, let's go to transmission. Let's give it air and water so it becomes more infected. Uh, and the infectivity goes up. Is there anything else over here in the symptoms I can give it? Yeah, let's give it nausea and uh, vomiting. Look how much the infectivity goes up with vomiting. <laughs> Our moms are making us vomit. <laughs> oh, good lord. Okay, so vomiting. Look at the infectivity. Uh, and then let's go to abilities. And let's give symbiosis one. Uh, and like I said, symbiosis makes it a lot harder for, uh, for the doctors to pick up on the parasite. So let's evolve that. Now